vlog. I am Gabrielle. If you've never been here before, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you would have known for the last vlog, if you would have watched the last vlog, and please do because it'll help your girl out. But you would have saw that we were in Chattanooga, Tennessee, and we decided to come back a day earlier. And let me tell you, I couldn't be any more happy. I couldn't be happier. I could not be happier. I love traveling. Don't get me wrong. I love being out and about. I love exploring the world. I love just, I love to be gone. If y'all don't know that about me, I'm just that way. But the feeling of getting back into your own bed is unmatched. Okay? It's unmatched. <laughs> I just, it's unmatched. But nonetheless, today is Friday, April the 5th. And I just got out the shower, just washed my face. I'm actually going to do my skincare routine with y'all while I'm sitting here talking to y'all. But I do use Proactive. And this is my face actually with nothing. I just washed it. I haven't put, I haven't done any um, like the step two or anything like that. But y'all see my skin? <laughs> Compared to, um, let's just say like earlier in this year or even like later last year, my skin was doing horrible. Um, I know it was from like my hormones and things like that because I told y'all previous times that I never had an issue with acne, even as a teenager. But the acne had just gotten real bad, I've seen. And this is for the people who are new, if you don't know, that's why I'm explaining it. But I had went to see several well i went to see two dermatologists but i've had several appointments with both to only not have any type of improvement so my mom suggested proactive which i don't know when proactive was a thing i did try to use it back then but i didn't have acne and it it made my skin bad but this time i understand that oh, excuse me with proactive you actually gotta have um an active breakout so that I had okay my face was bad like bad hyperpigmentation and everything but I don't you know share an updated skincare like routine with y'all maybe on the I got a couple of vlogs already in my <laughs> that I've been vlogging because I like I told y'all before I pretty much pick my camera up every day but I'll get around to doing like an updated skincare routine with you all so my ladies that are over 40 if you having some breakouts or some type of you know hyperpigmentation issues or whatever the case may be i'm only going to share what worked for me because i went through so many products y'all like so many different moisturizers so many different cleansers so many different serums only to like minimize everything to a very basic facial routine to target exactly what i got going on with my skin and it worked wonders so i can only share you know what worked for me but um yeah i just wanted to come in and start off the vlog i am getting dressed i'm about to i planned on um today's plan was to go hang out with my daughters we were going i was going to take them to lunch you know just kind of hang out but girl they had other plans like so y'all don't want to hang with your old girl i'll just run my errands which is basically taking stuff back. I just wanted to come on and start the vlog off and tell you all, hey, good morning and everything else. I hope you all had a blessed week. But I do want to show y'all, it was so cute. Um, on my last vlog, I did tell y'all that I did hit 500 subscribers. Again, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And also, if you're watching this vlog and my channel is your vibe, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'll leave it right here. I'll show you right here. Please go ahead and subscribe. I can't link myself right here, but y'all know what I'm talking about. Look right here. It's telling you to subscribe. Okay? All right. <laughs> of course, I shared with my daughters that I had hit 500 subscribers. And when we came home last night, they had surprised me. Had like some balloons. They had bought me like a little slice of cake. They bought me a gift card to Dunkin' Donuts. They had like the 500 um, like the numbers in the shape, you know, in balloons. Uh, what else did they have? Uh, oh, and some flowers. It was so cute and so thoughtful. And I was so surprised. 
So I thought that was so sweet, but I'll share that with y'all. It's all dismantled now, but I'll show y'all like the flowers and the car. Oh, and they had me some cars. It was, it was so sweet and thoughtful. So yeah, but I don't want to hold y'all too much longer. I'm about to go ahead and finish getting dressed, but I did want to come in and start the vlog off and say good morning. And I will pick y'all back up when I am um, leaving out the door. All right. All right. Y'all. They also got me some balloons here that says, well, it did say it was like hung up all cute and they got this little thing here. And then they also got me um, a Dunkin' gift card as well as a slice of vanilla buttercream cake, which I don't need, but I'm definitely going to indulge in this tonight. And then um, what else? Oh, the cars are upstairs, but they wrote some sweet stuff in there. So I won't show y'all all that. But yeah, I just thought that was so sweet of them. Hey, y'all. What should I say? Hey, friends. I don't really talk like that in real life. In real life, I would be like, hey, y'all. Like, that's literally how I talk, y'all. But um, I just dropped my daughter off. I'm about to head to Target. It is only 60 degrees today. I got on this little cardigan. Y'all shaking. I got on this little cardigan. I got on a jogging suit, but I do got on my Gucci mules or my Gucci size mules, whatever you want to call them. But I'm sick of this. I want to wear a sundress and I'm ready to be on rooftops. You know what I'm saying? To wear a spring. Where are you? Hello? <laughs> Goodness. But I will hit y'all back. I just wanted to come in and say what's up. How y'all doing on this Friday? And we in our car like we always are. <laughs> All right, y'all. My rap is over. I'll pick y'all back up in a minute. Bye. Hey, y'all. So, I'm back home for a hot minute. But I really had to come in and show y'all my home goods. Fine. It was so unexpected. Um, as probably all home goods shopping experiences are because you never know what you're going to find at home goods. That's why I think I love to go so much because it's almost like a treasure hunt. Like you, It's like literally you don't know what you're going to find. But these two items that I found, I was not leaving them. I had been telling y'all that I wanted to change my whole house around to like a neutral color. And then you would know like my living room area here is where like the blue was. But that was a color scheme in my house previous to this one. And I just kind of like added on when I was here. But then as time went on, I realized like I don't like colored furniture. I just prefer to like if I'm going to accessorize, I would accessorize with color. But actual pieces of furniture, I don't want to ever buy like a blue couch or you know just I had a I got this blue couch these blue chairs I had a purple chair at one point and that will never happen again but look what I found y'all these chairs right here what and if you know anything about furniture if you keep up with any kind of furniture Bernhardt has this exact same chair um, it, it comes in a variety of colors. The wood color is different on the Bernhardt chair and the seating is different. I don't know if you can like customize it or not, but the actual style of the chair is where I first saw it, which was on, at you know, on Bernhardt's uh, website. But it's like this deep, it's not actually black. It's more like a dark, dark walnut brown, but you really can't tell because the contrast between the seating and the wood makes it look darker than it actually is. But that's okay with me. But look at the price for the chair. And don't mind the wall. That was another reason like my other chair because it had, I'll show you in the back, on the back of it. But the metal kept, like anytime somebody sit in it, it slides against the wall and it was just digging into the wall. So now I have to um, get my walls repaired. But look how much the chair was. $179. What? I was not leaving them and I got two. I looked up on two. 
Now in on video on camera, it probably looks smaller than what it is, but it's perfect for the space. Like, and then I'm a, don't mind this, but these are the chairs that were in there. And this is the part that I was saying that was digging into the back of the wall. Now I'm gonna keep these and I'm going to have them reupholstered. The metal on here comes off and then I can get the seat reupholstered. I still love this, this seat. I don't ever want to get rid of these because I love them. I what I did want to shy away from more of the gold down here. Um, and just like accessorize with gold. So yeah, but I'm gonna keep these chairs. I really love the style of the chair and it's really comfortable. And then I'm about to, my mom wants those stools. So if she wants those, I'm gonna go ahead and give those to my mom, but I'm gonna take them out of here. Matter of fact, let me take them out of here real quick and let's see how it looks without them. And then I'll pick y'all back up in just a second. cheap the flowers were at the farmer's market so I was like you know let me get a pretty vase and think about it if I don't do it I mean the vase was $13 but I got this ribbed vase here and like I said it was only $12.99 so I thought this was pretty to do like a pretty arrangement in let me put it back in the bag and then this is what I was talking about that I grabbed from Target they only had it in a size 14 and it was the only one that they had. But Levi's got one exactly like this, which I was going to get until I saw the price. The Levi's jumpsuit is $59.99. I'm not paying $59.99 for a jumpsuit. This one was $36. Um, so like $20 less. But I feel like it looked a little better than the one from levi's though but i have to try it on i didn't try it on when i was in the store and like i said this is a size 14 and this was the only size outside of i probably could use a 12 but um i do want it to fit kind of oversized so it probably will fit just perfect and i think this one is a little longer too than the one from levi's so and i like it because it also has pockets on the back the only thing I'm not in love with is the fact that it has a belt. Um, and I don't have a flat stomach. So <laughs> I don't always like stuff around my waist. But we'll see what it's looking like. How we can finesse it if we if we can. If we can't, the receipt is in the bag and it will, it will be returned. Because I'm famous for returning stuff, okay? I don't even care. I picked up this, um, y'all would have seen this when I was in Chattanooga at Target. I got the white one. I showed my daughter thinking that she would like it. She said it was ugly. I thought it was cute. And I thought she would like it. But I just got this, um, I think I got it the wrong way. Hold on, let me figure out which way it go. Okay. Yeah, I got it the wrong way this bag down but y'all would have seen like I said I got the white one so I showed y'all the white one but it's just this little t-shirt here that got like this little kind of wrap effect to it and I got it in an extra large and it was $12 so 
So because I already had the credit for, um, you know, I had the little gift card for Target when I returned some stuff. I just picked this stuff up because that's really all they had, honestly. So, yeah, but I'll try this on once I come back and we'll take it from there. But yeah, I'm so happy about the chairs, y'all. So now I'm like activated to do spring haul. I mean, not spring haul, but like a spring refresh. Um, pull out some of my spring. I don't really have like spring stuff though. That's the thing. I don't really like per se decorate for spring. So I don't know. The little stuff that I do put out, like change my vase out and you know, stuff like that. I'll probably just do that. And um, we'll take it from there. So, all right, y'all. I'll see y'all in a little bit. Bye. Good morning. Today is Saturday. What is that big old bug? Good morning, y'all. Today is Saturday. Um, as you can see, I'm on my way out the door. Um, we are about to go to Target, Bath and Body Works, grocery store. That is on today's agenda. That is uh, today's schedule so far. I just wanted to come in and start the vlog off for today and show y'all that I'm mixing uh, winter clothes with summer shoes and everything else because as I'm sure it is all around the world, spring does not want to make its grand interest, okay? So I got on this old um, Nike sweatshirt that I've had probably about seven years, if not longer. It's, it's like... Um, trying to show y'all and I got all this stuff in my hand but it's like long in the back and short in the front and then I have on these Nike leggings but they have like like a netting kind of material in the um I guess like the thigh and then at the bottom there and I got on my Tebas and my everyday jewelry nothing special <laughs> but I did want to come in and start the vlog off for today. Um, like I said, we're about to get out of here. It's probably just now 12 o'clock. I, I really don't even know what time it is, honestly. But yeah, and I'm still loving my chair. Because I got two. <laughs> I don't know why, but I, I'm still loving them. But yeah, we're about to get out the door. I don't want to talk y'all ears off. I just wanted to come in and introduce today. Saturday, April 6th, and um, yeah, but I got to come back and edit because I got to get the vlog out for tomorrow too. So, all right, y'all. Well, I'll see y'all. Hey, y'all. So we made it into Bath and Body Works, but they don't have the designer collection here. So make sure you call your local store because she said that only select stores got them and this particular store did not get them. But um, Every day, I mean, every day. Um, today is, like I said, Saturday the 6th, and all of the body care items are only $5.95. And then I have a 25% off coupon, so I'm racking up. I got uh, my husband four, and so far I got two, and I probably grabbed myself four more as well. So, and then. My daughter got, what you got? Delilah. I got bourbon, strawberry, and vanilla. And I got, ooh, what is that? Oh, she like all the sweet stuff. I don't like the sweet stuff, y'all. So, I don't know. I don't see, the ones that I like are like these. But I don't see any of the ones that I usually buy. This is a new one that I'm trying. I got the eucalyptus, which is the stress relief. Uh oh, somebody did not come And let's see, uh, so yeah. Okay, a shampoo now? And conditioner? See the ones I bought. I like Bailey.
sleep while driving in the backseat What's left of me? Drowning in my fears just like an ocean Negativity is getting closer How to keep the heat when it gets colder, you know Sometimes everything just gets hard Sometimes everything just gets I don't know if y'all heard me or not over the music, but I was trying to say for those who are looking for like the designer dupe body sprays. I don't know what this lady behind. Um, the the dupe body sprays like for the designer collection or whatever. Some stores have them, some stores don't. She said they were only for select stores. So my store that I went into don't have it. So. I want to try another one because I'm very interested. I do have the Delina fragrance. All the other ones I've smelled like Santal 33 and all those. I don't like those. But I do have the actual Delina. Um, what is it? I have two Delina fragrances. I can't think of the name. But I do want to try and see about the dupe because that is one of my favorite fragrances. But it's so expensive that I don't really spray it that often because those... <laughs> those were 300 and something dollars a piece so i don't really spray those often but i love them a lot and i get a lot of compliments on it so to have the body spray would be ideal <laughs> but now we're about to go to alta and then i have to go to the grocery store i went in target i didn't bring y'all in target i just returned that um and i didn't even show y'all either but that jumpsuit that jean jumpsuit it fit but i would prefer it to be a little bit more like looser like it fit nice but i wouldn't be i don't know i didn't like it fit but i didn't like the way it looked i would prefer it to be a little bit baggier i guess i'm trying to say so oh excuse me so yeah so now we're about to shoot to alta and then we're gonna go to the grocery store and then we're going home and i'm drinking this All right, y'all, back. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Uh-oh. Where you going? Huh? Um, I think you old enough to follow your mommy. Eat acai bowls. Mm -hmm. They're good. And they're healthy. Come on. Oh, excuse me. Ooh. Ooh, thank you. What's that doing here? Or something. Hey, y'all. I done made it home. I think the last time I picked y'all up, we were in uh, Bath and Body Works. I'm probably shining. I've been outside getting the weeds out of the cracks. 
cleaning my screen door. Um, what else I did? I think that was about it. My lawn guy came today and cut my grass and cut my hedges and stuff. So, and when I put my little wreath on the door, my little spring wreath on the door. But I'm thinking about, I didn't show you. I think you, I don't know if y'all saw it or not, but I was thinking about staining the bench that's on my, um, on my porch. I really want like two really, really nice rocker chairs, but I don't know. I'm thinking about staining that bench though. I'm looking at it. So it's like, but anyway, I got an Amazon package and there's something in here that I wanted to share with you all because I know it is next season and um i picked up these about two and i just got some some more to plug in that i like two of those so i'm about to go around and refill those but i did want to share these with you all um they're called safer home you probably have seen commercials like i think it was Vivo or something like that. But this was like the recommended brand on Amazon. The Vivo, I think, was like 70. Um, the Vivo, I think, was like, I want to say like $36 maybe. <laughs> and these were only 17 So I bought two. And I'm going to put one upstairs and one downstairs just because I've seen a net or two. And I know, you know, this is that time of the year where they come out. So, and... Flies not really out. I haven't seen flies. It's still a little chilly here, so that could be the reason why. But I'm gonna open these up together. And let's see what it says. The instructions it says quick setup, so fairly easy. <laughs> Plug it in, I guess. But yeah, I just thought I'd share these with you all. Um, and then I'll also share with you all, if, like I told y'all, Bath and Body Works. I don't know how long that sale is gonna be going on for. But I do know that all the self-care, body care items, like the body wash, the sprays, uh, I think she said like the bath, every, pretty much everything was on sale for $5.95. And I'll show you all what I picked up from there. But um, yeah, that is all. Well, I guess this is a refill, I'm assuming. I don't know. I guess we got to read the directions, huh? <laughs> so... Let me do that, and once I get it all set up, I guess, I'll pick y'all back up in a minute, and I'll show y'all what I got from Bath & Body Works. Un momento, un momento. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> so, all you have to do is just peel the adhesive off of the back. I think the Vivo ones come, like, where the bugs are, like, inside, but luckily for this one, the bugs, I guess, stick to the back of it, so you don't see them. But that's pretty much all you do is you take the adhesive off and um, plug it up. So I'm going to plug this one by the kitchen, by the garden, like almost by the garbage can, basically by the back door. And then it comes with um, a refill. And then, like I said, I put the other one upstairs. So if anybody is interested, I will link them below. But... I mean, I guess it's good for pretty much anything. It says traps flies, fruit flies, moth nets, and more. So let's go plug it up. All right. So let me share what I purchased from uh, Bath and Body Works. These are the fragrances I bought me and my husband some. And don't mind, I still got these blue chairs from my living room. Still sitting here. I'm about to take those upstairs. I didn't do it last night. Um, but for my husband, these are, I got us both five of each. And I got him, these are the scents that I like for him, <laughs> for me. <laughs> but I got the Noir. Is it Noir? I guess. I don't know. Uh, bourbon. Ocean. They all smell really, really good. Graphite and fresh water. So I got that. those for him. For myself, I pretty much get the same ones. I did kind of switch it up this time and I got something different. But I got, um, let me see, that's the normal. Let's always get these. So actually,
only the only new one I got for myself is this Himalayan Oasis. Um, they all smell really good, but I don't. This is like one of the like you know like the spray one. I don't really care for those. I always go for like the. I don't know what these are called. I guess. I don't know. It's a certain. I forget the name of it, but it's a line with Bath and Body Works. Got this one is new. Like I said, this is the Himalayan Oasis. I always get this um, the stress relief. It's. It, I don't use it for necessarily like stress relief. It smells really good though. Like it's very relaxing. So I guess stress relief. <laughs> This is my absolute favorite one. This orange and ginger smell, this recharge. Oh my goodness, it smells so good. Oh, I love this one. Um, and then I also got deep breath. I was introduced to this one. My daughter bought me a few to go like in our stock of stuffers. And she, this was one of the scents that she bought. And it smelled amazing. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get that again. So... I got this one and then I also got this one. This one is new. Now I'm not a big fan of vanilla. This is the um, sleep one and it's lavender and vanilla. This one, let me see. It smells good. The van If you're not a vanilla person, like I don't like anything vanilla. I don't like vanilla scent at all. I don't like anything that smells like vanilla. This is more of a lavender than vanilla. So keep that in mind. If you're a vanilla person and you pick it up and you're like, oh, it's more, more lavender than anything. But it smells good. So it smells like you're ready to go night night. That's all I picked up from um, Bath and Body Works. And then I, I've showed y'all these before. I always buy them from... Amazon because I never see this particular scent in the store anymore, which is the blue agave and bamboo scent. Um, I don't know why. I, and I always look for them in Target and I never could find them in Target. I don't really frequent Walmart like that. So they may have them in Walmart, but I don't even go to Walmart like that. So yeah, but I'm about to make some nachos tonight so i'm about to make the ground turkey for the nachos i'm about to take these upstairs and i think i want to change out some of the stuff on my cocktail table in my living room i'm not for sure i'm just like in that i told y'all yesterday excuse me i told y'all yesterday i am like in the the spring I was activated with the chairs yesterday okay so now I'm like excited to kind of like do a little refresh and um spruce some things up for the springtime you know y'all know so I don't know if I'm gonna do that in this vlog oh and I forgot this little thing here this was I had coupons so you get this for free and I just got this at the beach fine mist spray i'll probably just throw this like in my um what am i trying to think of like my little vanity bag for when i travel and stuff like that pretty much all i got y'all for today so i will pick y'all back up if anything else is vlog worthy okay all right y'all hey y'all happy sunday a beautiful Sunday here in Georgia. It is actually almost four o'clock. Don't even know if I'm gonna be able to get Sunday's vlog out today. I'm definitely gonna edit it, but I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to get it out today because it's already four o'clock and I haven't even started editing. I got up this morning, had to shoot to the grocery store because I went grocery shopping yesterday. However, I forgot quite a few things. So I had to go back this morning and get things that I forgot to get yesterday because I needed it for today's dinner. And then from there, me, my mom, and my husband went back to the farmer's market. Yes, we 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 gonna make this an every other week thing. Like, I really enjoy going to the farmer's market, y'all. But while I was there, I picked up some flowers. Let me show y'all. Let me have them taped together. So, I remember I showed y'all this base that I got from Home Goods. It got water in it. But remember I showed y'all this base that I got from Home Goods. It was $13. And I got some 
baby's breath. I don't remember what the lady said these were called. Let me take them out. But I just thought they were different and they are a beautiful, beautiful color. Um, this is how they look. They're so pretty. And then I got a Birds of Paradise. Uh, yes, yeah, Birds of Paradise. These are absolutely gorgeous. So, we are about to attempt to make a flower arrangement. Put these out so y'all can see how beautiful these flowers are like. Look at this. Like, look how like summer and springy. Like they are so freaking pretty. And then they have these. And I felt like because I saw like this burgundy one here, that these would like tie in really pretty with this. So let's make a flower arrangement, y'all. <laughs> If you're Amazon, I don't know how it works for anybody else, but I literally ordered these last night and they came this morning. So, if you are an Amazon Prime member, you might get them the next day. But nonetheless, this is what they look like. I already put one together. The set of six were $59 and this is them put together. So like I said, I already have some out there. So what I'm going to do is actually just pull those up and put these right down in the same hole that the other ones are in. And um, so they can get charged up for tonight. Hopefully those will, you know. But you can actually take these too if you don't want to put them on a stick. If you're not intending to put them in your yard, you can actually mount these to like a wall or, you know, wherever you want to want to mount them at. They come with screws. Um, yeah. So they come with the screws and they also come with the anchors as well. So... I'll definitely link them below. Like I said, they come in a set of four. What's this? I think it was either a set of, yeah, they came in either a set of four or a set of six. Right now, I currently have six lights outside anyway, but I feel like these are brighter than the ones I do, um, that I have right now. So we are gonna see, cause they, oh, and they, another thing, they come in different colors. So you can get them in like multicolor. Like if you're into like, you know, the reds, the blues, the purples, the blah, blah, blah. They come in a cool, no, is it warm white and then a cool white? I opted for the cool white. When I read the reviews, most people had the cool white and they were really pleased with them and they're extremely bright. Um, so 
we're going to go ahead and put these outside take the old ones up and y'all guess what remember i told y'all i was looking for a kitchen table i found one i'm gonna order it today believe it or not it's on target's website it's so nice it's exactly what i'm looking for i actually seen a table that was very very similar i i don't think i vlogged it though I'm almost for certain that I didn't vlog it. However, they had it at Crate and Barrel Outlet. And the only thing that I did not like about the one at Crate and Barrel Outlet is that it had like the legs of it had like a like a design made into it. I didn't like that. So um, I ended up, I think it came across my feed when I was on Facebook or something like that. And I was like, let me look at this table. Girl, the table $400. It's only 400 bucks. Nice table, 72, everything that I was looking for. But for $400, you can't beat it. It's a nice wood table. It's black. It's very clean lined. So now I just have to find some chairs, which I'm actually going to look on Target's website as well for chairs because if you don't know anything about Target, Target website has some nice furniture. I'm talking about they have bedroom furniture, they have dining furniture, living room furniture. I actually showed my husband, he's looking for a new couch for his room. And um, I showed him a couch there and the couch was fairly inexpensive compared to what you would probably pay at a furniture store. And I don't think the quality is all that bad either. So yeah, I got these all put together. I'm just about to peel the little strips off of them and I'm about to go place these outside. And I see y'all outside. <laughs> okay, so y'all see these are the old ones that I have right here. And I got three over here. Don't mind the um don't mind the mulch. It gotta be redone and then this retainer wall would be redone as well. But I just love this little bush, y'all, and it only bloomed like this during a certain part of the year, like when it's blooming season, and then it turns all green, but it looks so pretty. And then over here, I have three as well. So I got one there, one there. Oh, actually I got four over here. Mm. Okay, so I don't know how that's gonna work, so. Let's get them removed nonetheless. I might not even need that one because I feel like the other ones are so bright. So, let's see. <laughs> ¶¶